right away. Good evening again, ladies and gentlemen, our exhibitions all over the world. I'm so delighted to be with you today. My name is Mbe Derek. Um, I am one of the many voices of TBC. I am so, so, so excited to be with you. This meeting is always every Mondays, Wednesdays, and Fridays, as from 8 p.m. West African time. Please, for those that are watching me on YouTube, do not forget to subscribe to my YouTube channel as we are always having lots and lots of interesting things there for you. Okay, today um, is weekend, Friday, and <laughs> I, I, I'm tempted to ask some of you uh, what you have been doing so far. Maybe we should do some personal analysis. Uh, uh, what you have been doing so far, those that have been having, those that have been uh, watching my trainings, um, you have been putting them into practice. And um, I'm tempted to ask you what is, how is your progress? I want us to uh, interact. Today will be a kind of interact, uh, interacting um, a training where we can correct mistakes where we can uh, see where uh, you are having difficulties and correct them. So um, feel free to talk, feel free to ask questions, feel free um, uh, where you're having challenges because trust me, before we go, before I come to you, trust me, I am doing something wonderful. My brochures are crazy. I'm signing up people like never before. And um, if you look at, um, let me quickly, uh, you look at uh, my my uh, oops. Let me look. You go to my criminal cash back office. Uh, we are signing up people like never before. And um, let me refresh my page here. Yeah, I was trying to just verify stuffs. Okay, so let me log in. Oops. So, um, if you look at the contest, it's a very tight one. If it's, it's a very tight contest. Ace Flesher will not allow me to win. So, the guy is on fire. We are actually on fire. But my objective is, a, is, my objective is to um, sign up at least 100 people per day because I really want to uh, pollute my entire town uh, uh, by getting at least at least 100 people per day. And um, for those that are attending my training in the office, you realize that I have met head people like pastors, head of departments in uh, in uh, universities. I have met a lot of people who can gather uh, uh, many people, and I'm signing up them like crazy. Uh, and when they are saying Bitcoin bounty program in addition to the cookie rewards that they will be having after a 24 hour period of signups they have kringles in their back office they are like what so trust me um it is working the brochures are going out i'm sending out at least a thousand brochure per week um if I, if i send out a thousand brochure per week and i sign up 100 people per week and even just 20 do transactions with me of course I know that I will be having at least at least a thousand dollar per week, which is not small. Uh, it's something. It's actually something. And um, I want all of you guys. My, my 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 concern now is that I want all of you guys to be on this pitch. Uh, I don't know what level you should be, but my concern is for you people to have at least a sign up. Last time I showed you people uh, my, um, my personal, if you look at the admin title, the training of last time, uh, the last time training, admin says Mbe shares his personal breakthrough in CBC. I'm sure many of you will remember this training last time that we had. And this training, I was trying to show you the growth curve last time. And I was telling you that I started about two months with the Bitcoin bounty program, and I could not have a single sign up. I could not have people coming in, and I keep trying many strategies, keep putting many things together to see that um, I get sign up, to see that I figure myself 
on the on the page on the on the on the on the uh, Bitcoin bounty page. And let me tell you a secret. Are you ready? <laughs> I mean, <laughs> let me tell you a secret. Are you ready? If you are ready for me to tell you a secret, then tell me. If you are ready, tell me. Maybe you should say yes. Maybe you should um, indicate. Let me tell you a secret. Yes. <laughs> yes, ready, ready, ready. Okay. Um, we are more than to, ready. I want to tell you a secret. I want to tell you a secret. Look, let me share my screen again with you. This is no, no, no. Sorry, I'm, I'm not supposed to show you this. Oh, come on. Uh, hold on. Okay. Let me, let me, let me show you a secret. The secret in the Bitcoin bounty program is to have at least a single sign-up. That's the first secret. At least a single sign-up for your name to be on the leadership board. That's the first secret. All right? To have at least a single sign-up for your name to future. On the, even if it's just one, that is progress. Many of you might be having zero. No problem. But try to have at least one. It all begins with one. I told you last time, it all begins with one. Do everything possible that before the next 10 button meetings, you have one sign up. You have one sign up. Look, there are three secrets. What I'm going to share with you now. Listen very attentively. There are three secrets in succeeding in this Bitcoin bounty. Secret number one, make sure that your name is found here. Let me tell you, all the exhibition globally are watching, are watching what is happening here. All the exhibition globally are watching what is happening in the Bitcoin bounty program. That's the first secret. Get your name here. Secret number two. Secret number two. Make sure that your name is found in the front page. You can have at least five signups per week, six signups per week. Let your name be on this front page. Once your name is on the front page, you will easily reach out, or people will easily reach out to you. Trust me, people will easily reach out to you because once they come in and they will have your names here, they will see the first page. Boom, who forget us? Boom, Mr. OKK. Wow, from Nigeria. Oh, this guy is great. You see Rwanda, you see Nigeria, and people be like, what? This guy's on fire. Let me contact this guy. What is this guy trying to do? Trust me, I have received more friend requests, and I have made more money than uh, 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 when my name starts figuring on the first page of the Bitcoin bounty program. I made more money. Because people reach out to me, oh, Mr. Mbe, I want to partner with you. Please, I want you to train me. I, the pressure has been so much that I have decided to carry on another special training for the Francophones. The whole the French community have been giving me a lot of pressure. <laughs> so I am starting a special French training next week, Tuesday, for the French community. Because they have been bouncing up. My inbox has been like crazy. That man we want. So that is the secret number three. First thing, have at least a sign up. Second, have your name on the first page. And lastly, win the contest. Win the contest. Let me tell you, whatever the case, I know that I will win a position. I don't know whether I will be first, second, third. But I know that there is a position for me to win this week. I don't know the position, but something will happen. Don't, ever since I started having five sign-ups per day, the graph curve has been uh, 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 increasing exponentially for my success. People will not follow broke leaders. Let me keep telling you this. And I am, I am, I am, in a, I am a typical example. People will not follow you when you are broke. People will follow you because you are succeeding. And for you to succeed, you need to walk the talk. You need action. Look at my training in the office. Even right in the office, Mufo Gilas was here with us in this training, and he's right here with us here today. He can testify to this. 
that the office yesterday took more time. Uh, it was it was packed. It was packed with 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 Tibetans. A new listen. Majority of these people they are just new signups. They are new signups. And of course, the, the the error many people are doing is that they want to succeed in the TBC community instead of going out there to talk to new, new people. You want to talk to people in the TBC community. And that's why you see many people creating stuff like exchangers because they want to profit in the TBC community. The real money is out there. I should tell people that I don't talk a lot. I don't spend a lot of people, a lot of time with old exhibitions. If you are old exhibition, join my trainings. Of course, I'm not charging you in the beginning. You only have reasons to partner with me if my training can help you. I spend more time with the new blood, people that do not have any knowledge about TBC. Of course, those that do not know me even. Those are the people I'm spending more time with. Those are the people I'm spending more time with. And that is what we should do. Once you have your brochures, they are going out, make sure you spend time, collect their numbers, and discuss with them, get them signed up. Error number two that some of you are doing is that majority of you want to explain the whole process before you sign them up. Guys, you need to plug them in. That's the first thing you need to do. You plug them in, and then the rest will come later. All right? You plug them in. Don't try to uh, 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 explain everything before you sign people up. You plug them in first, then you explain everything later. But many of you want to, do you know about cryptocurrency? Cryptocurrency started in 2018. In 2008, you know the first cryptocurrency was Bitcoin. Blah, 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 blah. No, plug them in. My friend, I have a gift for you. It's free of course. And I want, us, I want to sign you up and then we'll find time to talk about it. My friends, we are on a mission to eradicate global poverty. And we are signing up people for free. Do you know some people that might want to partake in this global campaign? Yeah, I myself, I want to take part of it. Okay, fine. Let me plug you in and then you know how it goes. Guys, get them in first. That's the error many of us are doing. My office is making like, I don't know, I'm having like 10 meetings now per day. And right now I'm training people that will be taking part only on training the people that are coming to the office. We are on fire. We are on fire. Meetings are going. Very soon I'll start shooting videos, showing you the people that are coming to the office, how, we are, how they are sharing their testimonies. You are going to see it. I'm working on it. I want to transform my land, a TBC land, the entire city. Once I finish with this city, I'll go to the next city. We must, we must, and I'm telling you this, we must reach our objective of one billion people by the end of next year. So let us plug them in first, then the rest will come later. So I, that being said, I want us to discuss some of our personal challenges. Let me talk to you now like a professional who is signing up at least 50 people per week. Now let's see what is happening, what are the challenges you have, and let's correct it right away. Who do I start with? Raise your hands. Let us start right now. Thank you. Yes, um, let me start with Mr. Ado, Adone, Adonigi, something like that. Pardon me. <laughs> Adonigi. <laughs> All right, all right. Yeah. Good evening, everyone. Good evening, yeah, my name is Damien Collis. I do you from Nigeria. Thank you. Yeah, the I enjoy your training today where you say we plug them in peace. <clears throat> you know, in this part of our world, many at times people want to know exactly what they are coming in. If you don't explain to them the details. Sometimes they may not even want to be part of it. The reason is not far-fetched. As an African man, we want to know inside house, know outside house, 
know what is in the kitchen before we're able to put anything there. Yes, I agree. The TBC is uh, to eradicate poverty. But you have to have it in mind that plucking them in without paying the wallet fee will not yield anything. How do we do that? Right. Okay. Thank you very much, sir. Now, let me tell you something. Um, we have people that are business minded. We have people that have business mentality. Like they want to, uh, they want to um, uh, uh, expand, or they have business mindsets. Those kind of people is very easy to plug them in. And there are people that want to know everything before they join your program. If you don't tell them anything, they won't join. Fine. Fine. There is something I'm doing. Look, right now, I have signed up more than 100 people. But not all of them have paid their back offices for this week. Now, when you gather those people, plucking them in, you need to sort them out, those that are serious. You need to, because you have those that you must explain everything. That's the Africa, that's some of the people's mentality. But there are people that have great mindset. Trust me, Mr. Deni, uh, um, Adoni, you have more than 100,000 people in your city. How many have you talked to this week? Do you think if you have talked to five, is it enough? My brother, I just told you that I have 1,000 brochures that have gone out. 1,000 that has gone out this week. Today, it, today is just Friday. Since Monday, I've, I've even paid people to go out there and share the brochures. You know what I mean? And people are calling, people are sending these text messages and getting them sign up. The brochures, first of all, is explaining some of what we are doing, not all. But when they come now meet you in person, the story is different. So you, you are intention. Look, there was a millionaire that says that he gave a statistics. I, don't, I can't remember him very well, but it's a network marketer or something. They were asking him what was the secret of his, of his achievement. He said he got millions of people. He got millions of people. He, he explained his business to millions of people. About hundreds of thousands were interested. And few hundreds were oh, joining. And that's what makes him successful. You cannot. This is what I'm telling you, my experience. At first, I could do just... I could touch just 50 people for a per week. And I was thinking, I was, I was like, what? I'm killing it. I was doing icebreaker. I was doing, if you go to my YouTube channel, you'll see my 90 days challenge where I, I'm doing icebreaker. I touched nearly everybody on my Facebook page. And I was having a result. I, I, I had my personal discipline. And I can still show you, they are, on, they are inside my computer. Yeah, but... Despite all that effort, only a few were still showing up. And none, some, sometimes, none will even register. But that did not stop me. But at one point in time, I realized that the number of people I'm touching is too small. And I stepped up the game. And today, I'm telling you that I want to touch at least, this is my objective. If I can touch 1,000 people per week, then definitely I'll be able to touch 1,000 per day. I will be able to duplicate. You need to duplicate yourself. You need to have people that are helping you to duplicate yourself. Of course, many of us, we have many things that we are doing, but to expand, to, 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 to increase your revenue to a certain level, to have a good passive income, you need to touch more people. Those that want to take more of your time, Mr. Adoni, I'm still answering your question. Those that want to take more of your time, leave them first and get to those that want to get serious. If you touch a thousand per week like me, you definitely have at least 20 signups. Are you ready for that, for that challenge? <laughs> All right. Okay, let me go to the next person. I'm seeing MDS. Unmute yourself, Are you go ahead, sir.
Um, you are not muted. Okay, go ahead. I just muted you. Okay, can you hear me now? Yes, sir. All right, thank you. Uh, we thank God for today because uh, today was another encounter day I have again also because since morning I've stepped out uh, from one meeting to other and uh, along the line I go with my flyer that I've produced to promote TBC. So now in Nigeria as one of my colleagues have just said about Nigeria. You know, in, uh, in each country, we have a different challenges. And then when it comes to Nigeria here, yeah, let me first of all mention it. In the time of MMM, anyone that knows MMM, MMM has been a serious uh, something that really damaged the mindset of the people in Nigeria. Because a lot of people put their money there and expecting return. And then along the line, uh, fuck up came up. And then since then, if anyone mentions anything like this, they say, uh, it's just like MMM, that just took their money away and so on. Then some don't know how to bring them down. Like in my flyer now, it's there that CBC is not MLM system. It's not MMM system. It's not networking. So today, when uh, after the meeting, I start sharing the, this thing with, or with people that, uh, OK, uh, CBC, this is what it's all about, and so on. Then the first thing that someone asked me, and which are the encounters to satisfy that? Okay, you said this thing is a cryptocurrency. Good and fine. We have under control over it, yes. Then, now, in Nigeria, yeah, is it well acceptable for payments? Then, I answer, in some area, it has been well accepted right here in Nigeria. And even in my office, you can spend it. And now I've included another method of 50% CBC, 50% cash without any condition that you can spend your CBC with 50% CBC, 50% cash for some goods. So not to all goods. Then the next thing is I say, okay, what of if I need cash? How am I going to go about it that maybe I want to pay for house rent, I want to pay for children's school fees that need cash. What am I going to do about that? Because that is what people do to ask. Then I say now, on that, one, if you need cash, there is a way out for you to get cash. But with a time and condition that attached to that. And that condition is that if you are ready to exchange your uh, 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 CVC Kringle to cash, that means you must ready to share the same opportunity with others. That means from you, you will be a stepping stone for others, so that from you, they will move to next level. But if you can't share the news with others, the opportunity with others, that means you may find it difficult for now to exchange it to cash. Because okay, if um, you don't, uh, uh, MGS, please, I want you to yeah. go directly to the question, right? Now, the, the specific. Now, the, now, the question or what to say is this. Now, if someone asks that, okay, this thing quite all right is an opportunity, then how can now make cash out of it? Do you have a different answer to what I've already given? Let me tell you something, the mistake you are doing. Okay. The first, the first, I'm sure you just joined my training. Maybe you have not met one month. We have been doing this training for six months. Yeah, yeah. The first mistake that you are doing, honestly, <laughs> if I'm in Nigeria, I'll make a lot of money. A lot. Let me tell you the truth. Forget. Forget. But I was MLM. I know uh, MLM. I know it. In my country, no one yeah. came. 
They were calling it Mida, something in my country too, and it had the same effects. But has that stopped me from making money? No. Start by working that in your mind that that shouldn't be an obstacle. Remove the idea <laughs> from your mind. Remove it. Clean it off. Off. That is not an obstacle. That is even an opportunity for you to excel. Of course, MLM made how long? Did it make up to two years or three years? It didn't. Just a few months and it went away. But you have something that is three and a half years. They, have, they are legally accepted worldwide. Legally. The USCC have started try to stop it, but it can't. That is a tool. Now is for you to sell the vision. The first mistake you are doing is that you are selling, you want to sell the uh, immediate benefits. Don't do that. Sell the vision. And, and what is that vision? Um, I'm answering this question for everybody. What is that vision? The vision is that we are on a mission to eradicate global poverty. It's a campaign without obligations. And this campaign will enable us to gather one billion people on earth that will be doing transactions among themselves. Are you willing to be in this kind of a campaign? If you are not willing, fine, have a good life. If you are not willing, fine, have a good life. But trust me, in this campaign, in this campaign, we are also making money. Do you want to learn that part? Okay, fine, but do you agree with us that we are on a global campaign that it's a long term and we are about to eradicate poverty? Don't you like poverty? I've even given you people here. You were not here, MDS. You can even start by asking somebody, what do you think about poverty? What do you think about poverty, misery? What do you think about that? The person will like, it's, a bad, it's something very bad, it's something not nice, blah, 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 blah. Many countries suffer from this, 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 that, 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 that. Tell the person, I belong to a community where we are carrying out a campaign globally to eradicate poverty. We are three and a half years old. And we are legally accepted. You want to join our campaign? Okay, fine. How do I join your campaign? Sign up. Get started. Here is my link. Just sign up to this link. And the next step is for you to join our community, join our trainings, join my leader. Error number three that you guys are doing. You are not connecting your leaders to your prospects. Of course, I'm giving the only person here that gives me a lot of headache is Madame Adiola. Madame Adiola sometimes, she just pity me that I'm tired, I should go and sleep. He is the highest person that will lead me to her prospects. But many of you are not looking for a means to link yourself or to link your leader to your prospect. You come here, you gather knowledge. You think that you can apply alone. You need your leader to support you. Is it because you don't want to share your 50%? Let me get it. Is it because you are afraid that when your leader will come in and you will do transaction and you will have just 50%, like seriously? Is that the reason? Now, I have enough proof to give to any person in the world about CBC. Any person, I have enough proof to give. And you guys are making a lot of mistakes. Common mistakes. Those things need to be eliminated. And remove those things in your mind that what would the people tell us? What will, uh, if I want to get my money back, who told you we want to get money back? Did I tell you that you, are, you want to invest in a bank here? I tell you we are on a mission to eradicate poverty. 
And that mission is you know, one billion people. Have we reached one billion people yet? No. Do you love poverty? No. Are you willing to join our program, global program to eradicate poverty? Yes. Plug in. Get yourself in. What, what? I don't need to tell you about the advantages in the beginning. I need to sell the vision. Sell the vision, my people. Don't go and be talking money. Yes, of course, I know you need money. But you, if you walk that way, you can't. And once you want to talk money, that's when you bring somebody that has proofs. That's when you bring the third party to talk money. Because the third party has enough evidence to make the other person to first. So, whatsoever has happened in your country should not stop you. Should not. I am, I, am, I am an African and I belong to a community where people have been scammed. But you have something in your hand. But it all depends the way you are putting your stuff. Right? It all depends the way you are putting it. Don't go and be selling the profit. Sell the vision. Sell the vision. Nobody loves poverty in this world. Nobody. Invite them for trainings. Let us see what happens next. Thank you. MDS. No. Thank you very much. I, I, I really love that. You know, uh, the Bible also said it. The Bible said, don't lay on your own understanding. So, Anyone that wants to go more higher needs to acquire more knowledge. Because in Nigeria, they will say something that's black to someone, it may be white to others. So, and then I, I really understand, you know, sometimes if you focus, I mean, if you uh, um, come in, in contact with some challenge, you would like to see how to come to their normal standard. I mean, they are lower standards to let them understand what we are trying to pass to them. But I think I grabbed something from what you, you just said now. What we are looking for is that the people with a mission to help people out of poverty. That is it. And with this, there are some benefits that go with follow. it. Follow. Once yeah, you say I the grab, vision, I grab it. I grab the, rest it. Of the, ben the rest of the thing will follow. That is it. When you say the vision. So let's sell the vision, people. Yeah. Okay, let me yeah. go to uh, uh, Move for Gidas, Move for Money. Hello. Yeah. Yes, sir. Hello, sir. Yes. Good evening, sir. Okay, Simon. Uh, go ahead, sir. Yeah, but I'm an addict. You. you only mentioned Madame Viola blinking people. You didn't mention me. <laughs> <laughs> no, I said she is the highest. I'm sure you are the second. Okay, let me be precise now. Okay. You are the second. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> <laughs> yes, uh, you have said it to him, to MDS, because we, we are Nigerians, and as Africans, you have also experienced, like you said, the same thing in your country. One should not, it is a mindset, one should not think that such would, would be an obstacle for us to achieve our goal. No, I have never believed like that, because the, 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 the struggle now is slow because of that. But it is not unsurmountable. The, the mentality of the people is about what has happened. And it, they are finding it difficult to leave it behind. But then, it is our consistency in pushing the vision to them that will finally rub off that bad uh, experience of them. I know that as Nigerians, once that thing is, that bad experience goes off, we'll go one way, boom. Not, it, will, it will be so much. But for now, we are dragging feet because of that. But we get there. And right. because I've, I think I, uh, one, one, one prospect today when I was talking, I said, well, I'm in a mission to write a global power. He said, that is, that, that is not possible. <laughs> I laughed. I told, I now told him that in the, if, for the past 50 years, somebody have told, I told you, if somebody have told you that, 
somebody can travel up the air, you will say it is not possible. But it's possible today. People are traveling air, <laughs> but it's not possible. Right. So, and I'm going to, I told him, I said, no, that, you know, people, some people come here to suffer poverty. So, then I asked him, if people come here to suffer poverty, are you telling me that if you are in the you have opportunity to bring about abundance to the person that is, you, you leave him because he come here to suffer poverty, he couldn't answer the question. You must be prepared because each client has his own way, has his own peculiarity. But if you are not well equipped, so tackle him as he brings up all those uh, uh, obstacles. You punch them up. You will not be able to move. I know that because of that challenge, what we should do, what I'm telling the idea is that what we should do is that you first pursue those who know you, those you have related with them, those who know that you have not been dubious. Mainly, it could be family members, it could be your friends, which you have made. Those are the people you follow first. True. Before you now start launching out gradually because of the way our country is and the way they have suffered through all that MMM. I am now first tackling my family members who know me and know my character. And now moving towards my friends who know me and know my character. Those are the people I'm pursuing. By the time they know that, ah, this is the person talking to me about this thing, they are already interested. But just that they have a challenge that I should wait, let money come, they are going to follow up. So it's patience all. And perseverance always leads to the goal. You must persevere. That's right. Thank you very much, sir. Thank you very much for that contribution. Okay, I'm seeing uh, Move for Money wanted to say something. Uh, go ahead, sir. Okay, good evening to everybody. <laughs> it has been really uh, an awesome time. Are you getting me? Yes, sir. Okay, uh, uh, maybe you're not seeing me. It's because the internet was disturbing in the house. Uh, that is, I've been out. I'm out like this. I'm listening to you people. You should not bother. No, not we don't need your face. We need but the knowledge. <laughs> <laughs> so it has been an awesome, awesome time hearing from you since then. But what I would tell uh, most of the people on uh, on the show this evening is that we have gone a very long way with TBC, and I will not lie to everybody. Everybody has an experience to showcase as far as TBC is concerned. If you look at the chat, I just said that what a vision said clearly and plain. You know, when we read things at times, we do not really know how to break it down to fit to the people that are around us. It is when we started this campaign of Brochu that I've been out almost every day, even today I was out, that I've come to realize that we were saying the things, but not at the level of which most people were getting it. So now when it has been broken down, 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 down to the lowest level, when they assimilate, they just start thinking of how they can make it with TBC. So the vision and the mission of TBC is what we should put forth and we should explain it as simple as possible. So that is what is working for me now and I'm really making a whole lot as far as this new way of seeing it is. Because if you do not believe in something, you cannot go right into you and move the right words to permit the person that is in front of you to get it. So the reality now is all about putting the vision first and secondly, telling the person what they stand to benefit to be part of the community. Because as the earlier panelists have said it, there is nothing, nothing, nothing as great as TBC with its vision. So, guys, we are on a great mission. Let's run with it with all our personality. We will never regret to have been part and parcel of the TBC committee. Right. So, before I allow you to continue, I know the time is already getting down. I will really thank each and every one that has created time to be here. This is the place to have the right information. I've been in the TBC Commission for Rome. I've been formed with many, but you are cutting the reality in small chunks that just go directly to the right positions. So, sir, I give you applause for your work Thank done. You. Thank you so much, sir. Thank you so much. Thank you so much. Wow. <clears throat> All right. Um, should we take the last but one person, maybe, uh, contribution or question? Because I don't want anything to hold you back. I don't want yes. anything. I want that next week, before we arrived here for our next training, I should be seeing your names 
at least one person on the leadership. <laughs> Mr. Okay. 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 My brother Embe. <laughs> well, thank God I'm here today, you know, <laughs> and, um, you know, when, um, when you stop learning, what that means is you're closer to the grave and um, sure. I don't want to be, I don't want to be closer to the grave now. So I'm, <laughs> I'm, I'm learning how to learn, you know? And um, the truth is that the results may not be coming. And I was very, very encouraged, you know, when I saw, you know, I mean, um, your, your, your testimonial, you know, and, you know, it's, um, it's a great encourager. Thank you, sir. Because um, a lot of people, you know, especially here, you know, people believe in uh, when you when you plant corn today, it will germinate today, it will mature today, <laughs> you will eat it today. It's wow. not like that. True. Are, if, even in our Greek, there is a period of you know gestation, you know, where where you have to wait for what you have planted to get to maturity. And even when you have planted, you also have to nurture it, okay? And nurturing is what we are doing or what we are being encouraged to do continually within TBC community. What we are planting is the distribution phase, the seed that we are sowing into people's lives. That is what we are planting. Sometimes some of these seeds, they take a lot of time, you know, for them to germinate. Even when they germinate, they take a long time before they start, you know, bringing out uh, fruit and seeds. Okay, right. so that is where we are now. All I'm saying, and I'm talking to myself as well, we must, we must know that patience is a virtue, you know, and we must inculcate patience. So long as we are properly focused, doing the right things, a day will come. You know, I mean, I, 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 you know, I say this a lot. Just keep unloading the cloud. Don't bother. You know, just keep focused. You know, keep your eye on the ball. Don't, don't miss, you know, don't take your eye out of the ball, otherwise you will lose focus and miss the goals. True. But so long as you continue to focus, <laughs> All right, a day is coming when, when the cloud is filled up, the rain must come down. And uh, that is where I am. I'm walking, you know, tirelessly. Thank By you. the time this rain will come, it will be cat and dogs. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you so much, sir. Thank you. Thank you so much for, for that, great, um, that great contribution. Let me, let me take Reverend Emmanuel from Ghana, please. <laughs> I'm waiting too. Douglas is waiting here too. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. Good evening, Mr. Embe. Good evening, sir. It's been a nice time having a fellowship with you. Thank you. Uh, I greet everybody in the community. Uh, I've really been blessed since I came in contact with you. I've been encouraged with your training, consistency, persistency, and all that. The other time I, I, I contacted you for the brochure and I studied it. I've done my own way. I've started distributing flyers all over and uh, trying to start some seminar on, uh, uh, on Sunday after church. And so whatever results that comes, you surely see it on the board and also show you some videos and all that. Right. I thank you for the teachings and everything. God bless you so much. Thank you so much, Reverend. Thank you so, so much. <laughs> okay, Mr. Douglas, go ahead, sir. Yes, uh, I just want to thank you for an explosive week. 
<laughs> from the same meeting to today is really, really explosive. Thank you, sir. I was being a bit patient in uh, launching out. What I was doing was just listing who and who and who and who I'm going to approach first. <laughs> because I made your training on day 50 or thereabouts. So I had to, first of all, go back and uh, update before um, launching out. So that we not just, yeah, just jump into the waters and then start uh, struggling. <laughs> you know, but so, far, so good. I think uh, it's been awesome. Thank you. So I sent a question you promised to answer to um, this evening. So maybe I just hold on for that. Yes. Um, let me check the question so that we can quickly answer the, the, the question. Question number one, I need clarification with the referrals reward. If I register and get two persons under me within 24 hours, I earn 10 million cookies, and if I help them get their two each within 48 hours, is it me that will earn the 100 million cookies? Yes, it will be you that earns the 100 million cookies. That's question number one. Question number two, looking at the cash flow system, will I, will I earn anything else from their downlines? Or oh, the 100 million cookies is what I get for that set of six persons. Yes, from that set of six persons, that's what you earn. Your duty oh. is to help the six to create their own six so that you can now create what they call a rally team. We had a training here with a rally team. The six okay. people who help you create a rally team, you will now invite now your leader to talk to that six people and they will do transaction with you. And once they do transaction with you, you will now make 50% by inviting your leader to talk to the six people. So the excellent oh, okay. create a rally team for a cash flow. You understand that? Okay. okay. If, uh, number three, you say, if my 24 hour has expired within a referral, but I eventually start duplicating, will I earn anything from every six person that emerged or just, um, uh, just on the first person that registered with my link? Yes, once the 24 hour uh, 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 expired, you can go as 48 hours. Once the 48 hours has expired, you do not earn cookies again from, from that network, from that very network. You, call, you only earn cookies for those that sign up with your personal link. But once 48 oh. hours is over, the six people, you do not earn anything from them again. Hope that answers your questions. Thank you very much. You're welcome. You're welcome. All right. <clears throat> Um, do we have last person to say something before we go? Because we are almost time, we're out of time. Madam Adeola, the last speaker. <clears throat> Meet yourself. Yes, I did not want to speak, <laughs> but um, <laughs> you actually, you actually lured me into speaking. And what I want to say is my own challenge is is getting you. <laughs> and you know. <laughs> My challenge is getting you. Right now, I'm looking at a list of five people mm -hmm. who were, you know, bearing in mind my, um, the time zone and the, you know, messages would have <laughs> messages would have been there asking me I want to speak with you I want to and I have five who want whom I have said give me your number for your whatsapp number I will you know um, call you on a three-way call and I, I just I just get deflated when I cannot get okay. you that's my challenge <laughs> Yes, um, uh, we can solve that. You know, let me tell you something. <laughs> billionaire people, billionaires are very professionals. You know, sometimes we need to be very professional enough to uh, organize our work. Um, it's true. Um, when, 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 when a lady, for example, asks a number of a prospects, there is a high tendency that the anxiety is higher. Like you want to really talk and... And I'll just understand it. Just the fact that it's a lady is an added advantage. Let me be honest with you. But now, you, you now have to, um, 
organize your work and know how to play your game very well. Like, okay, let us talk. Let us talk, let us talk, let us, let, let us talk in, a, in an hour from now or tomorrow. Let's have an appointment. You know, try to have an appointment. It should not be like, let me talk to you in 30 minutes or let's talk in 30 minutes. No. And let me, let me tell you, another aspect that gives you more value is when you give an appointment and a bit of distance. You are not, it doesn't show some level of being desperate. Like you are just, just but when you say, okay, let's pick an appointment. I'm a little bit busy now, but I hope that tomorrow by this time, we can have a one-on-one -on -one talk on WhatsApp or a conference call. That gives you also some weight because the person knows that you're a busy person. That also gives me enough time to feed you in my program, you know. <laughs> but when you just come up and you say, can we talk in an hour from now or two hours from now, trust me, you will never see me. <laughs> so always, always try to pick an appointment. And sometimes before you even pick an appointment, you can also try to get to me real quick so that we confirm that you pick an appointment with the person. You understand what I'm saying, what I mean? So that way, you, you should be professional. Of course, you are, you, you are a millionaire. And millionaires know how to organize their work and make it look very professional. So don't worry. We'll get them. We'll get everybody on board. So after this, we can pick an appointment for tomorrow. Like I can tell you that tomorrow by 10 to 12, I can be available for you. And we can solve all the problems that you have. Eh, madam? Yeah. <laughs> Okay, um, what's the maximum number that can be on a three-way call? I, I think it should be five. Five. Okay, five. Yeah. Okay, that's inclusive um, yourself, five. Yes. yes, five. It should be five. All right, all right. I'll, I'll see how we can, we will work out. So all you right. say around 10 to 12. Maybe yes, I'll be available tomorrow. 10 to 12. Tomorrow. 10 to 12. Okay, your own time, fine. Yes, my time. I'll, but, yeah, I have to work it out and see. <laughs> or if Thank you can work maybe towards the evening, your time, we, we can see something just towards the evening. Okay. Because I will leave the office tomorrow uh, earlier than usual. Okay. okay. All right. I think that is that for today. Um, that is that for today. We have uh, our weekends to enjoy. So I am wishing you success. I am wishing you everything that you desire for yourself. But trust me, Go home with the idea of mass adoption. You need the mass and then you sort them out and nothing should disturb you in your mind. We have hundreds of people who are just waiting for this opportunity out there. There are just so many, but you haven't gotten to them and you need to just figure out your mind, meditate on it, and before you know it, the universe will just connect. It just connects you with the kind of people that you need to meet. That is, that is how it works. So there is no challenges in your mind. Once you create a resistance in your mind, the people you, you need to meet will not, will not show up. But once you just, you, just, you just feel free and believe in it and connect, boom, it happens. Okay, thank you so much. Uh, Monday uh, will be another time. Don't forget the send button meetings on Monday as from 5 p.m. West African time. And also our trainings will be at 8 p.m. West African time. Thank you very much. See you on Monday. Bye-bye. Bye-bye. Thank you.